giant tourist movie. Shout out. Alright, that's it, chat. I want to talk to everybody's manager right now. Is the manager in chat? I, I want to know right now. Welcome again, guys, to all the new members. Welcome to all the new subscribers. Welcome to everybody. Good to see you all here. Thanks for smashing like and hanging out with me. Got some new emotes for you, members, so check them out. I think Karen's in there somewhere. Somewhere in there. Good to see everybody here. Hi, what's going on? What's, what, what's poppin', crew? Oh, and it's Harry's birthday. 
Happy Karen to you. All right, let's get going. Uh, we're going to play this again here today. Foundation, we're going to continue on from our building yesterday where we started a whole new um, kingdom yesterday, and it was pretty fun. Tomorrow I might, might be, be playing something different because the update for um, Industries of Titan comes out, so I want to give that a try. We'll jump over here. i got to adjust my camera a little bit, and then we'll get into our uh, save from yesterday. Should be pretty cool. Yeah, wow, look at all those Karens. Wow, there's a lot of Karens in chat. I didn't, I did not realize we had so many people named Karen in the chat. I mean, I see a few people there, like Skull and playing Upbeat and stuff, but I didn't know their, I didn't know you guys' real names were Karen. I didn't know that. Harry's real name is Karen. There we go, that should be good. Perfect. All right, uh, thank you very much, Skull, for the $4 with the uh, little coffee. Appreciate that. Back to the kingdom of Rune Morn. Not Raptoria. I know. Keep in mind, anybody who becomes a new member or whatnot will be trying to name stuff after anybody who's, like, Raptor Ultimate tier. We'll try to name some big old buildings after all of our biggest supporters. All right, let's see where we were with our little kingdom. Looks like money's coming in now that we got the wheat farms going. And we just need to wait, I guess, a few more cycles for enough wheat to be made so flour can start flowing into the uh, mill and then eventually into the bakery. To which, wow, 56 bread has already been made just here? Holy crap. Oh, yeah, we got to tell the granary to store it. Otherwise, it's never going to get delivered to market. There we go. Same with the fish. Bum, 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 bum. Bum. Yeah, all the games I'm planning on playing should be down below in the description, so make sure you check the schedule. Read the uh, title in its entirety and also the uh, uh, just the, the, the description. The, the description. Uh, Simulot was great last night. Oh, good. Yeah, he was building uh, his kingdom, too. Oh, also, I might get uh, more keys to this game as well, so uh, when we do our giveaway, if you win tonight's giveaway and want to hold off... Until I get more keys from the developer, you can win this game as well. Yeah, we're get, we're getting that bread. That's right. And check this out. Got our envoy on the way. This looks like the Quaker Oats man on the back of a horse. All right, let's see what we got here. Envoy's requesting presents. I need to unlock what? Probably... Hmm. I guess we could go for Kingdom. Yeah, we'll try to level out all of our stuff all together. Let's go for the king. We should have enough stuff to complete this already. Easy. Nice. Job done. Good job. Alright, so let's get some more bread and stuff going. I think if we've also got all of our people going. Bah, 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 to where they need to, so let's see. We've got... Oh! Nobody... Oh yeah, we got a few unemployed. That's actually good. Because that means we can make more bakeries and more farms. Let's see how the farming's going. It looks like they're starting the season now. What do you have to do to win a key? Oh, you just have to become a member. We do uh, members-only giveaways. And they're pretty cool. see so we're waiting for the wheat farm I'm trying to see if the wheat farms actually grow any bigger it seems to be an awful small farm here oh then again the workers have to walk all the way down here yeah it's a long walk to get to the farms so we'll have to build some homes down here too then so let's build a well and a small market here so they, they don't have to walk as far we can actually build this town here it's be perfect And we'll clear some of this land out, too. Yeah, the music's good, isn't it? Alright, let's tell our people to... Start cutting down trees over there. And we'll build a small town down here, so that way the farmers don't have to walk as far to get to work. Miner could not find an extraction zone for stone. Uh. Hmm. Oh, 
How are you guys getting stuck there? Oh, they're just standing there. Okay. And then they go home. They're working, but they just stand there when they're on break. Oh, this is good. It looks like they've made quite a bit of wheat. So I'll probably build a granary here so we can store all of it there. That's good. Bah, bah. I shouldn't have to walk this far, Karen. <laughs> all right, all right, Karen. We'll we'll make you a uh, we'll make you a house near the farm. Then we got to make some building here. Actually, we could probably make a road through and build something up here. Ah, my own personal home. Keep me safe from Karen. All right, let's see. Market. We'll do, uh, let's see. Don't really need too many complicated markets at the moment. I think just like bread and berries and fish should be fine to start. Actually, let's, let's put it back here. If I build it over here, it'll be a lot more space efficient. Bum, 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 bum. Bum, bum. Yeah, it'll be cool if there's a big monument we can build in the future. Right now, the buildings in the game actually all do something, so that's kind of cool. Like, when you build a monastery in this game, it actually does stuff. Kind of neat. You wish this game had trains? Ooh, imagine if it were, like, more of a modern... Like a Wild West builder game. That'd be cool. I'd love that. Alright, let's build some houses down here. See if anybody wants to build a house. Uh, how are we doing on churches, by the way? Zero out of 20 there. And... One out of twenty here. Probably doesn't hurt to like build a church in every little part of the town, though. And as soon as we get a marketplace, that should attract more people down here. Oh, plus we need to get more people promoted to serfs. So we'll do that as soon as we can. As soon as we can upgrade some more. Now that we got money, we went from like what zero to four hundred real quick. Bread is money, baby. You purchased this game three days ago. Awesome. Very cool. <clears throat> Oh, there's not a Wild West game like this. The only thing I can think of that's close to this is a game called Depraved. That's about it. Uh, yes, the paths are made from walking, just like in Ostrieve. But in this game, you can actually tell people like where to walk and where not to walk. So if you want to force them across a bridge, kind of makes it look really cool that people will actually use the bridge. Oh, they're working hard. Oh, good. It's done. All right. So let's go ahead and assign berries, bread, and fish. And assign workers. And then we'll get some more serfs. And then they should build more homes. Everything in this game takes a little bit of time. Whenever you have to do something, it just takes a little bit of time to get it done. Looks like we could build another wheat farm over here. And we could actually start doing sheep up here, because, you know, sheeps and stuff kind of can stay in the highlands. So that'll be fine. We should make a cult. The Karen cult? The only cult I know about is the Blue Oyster cult, but we could try the Karen cult. They, they, they really care. Here at the Karen cult, we really care. Let me speak to the manager. Bum, bum, bum. At this rate, we're going to have to build another mill, too. Build another wheat farm here. Oh, promotion's available. Yay. Okay, let's upgrade our highest levels. Yeah, we have the Karen cult now. The Culto Karen. 
We'll upgrade our level threes and fours. And then let's upgrade our level fives. And there's a few level fours here. It's a little too many for what I have available. I think I need to start providing clothing before we go any further than this. Otherwise, they're going to get mad soon. Bum, 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 bum. I'm old enough to be familiar with the Blue Oyster Cult. Yeah. Yeah, bro. What's that one song, 25 or 624? All I can remember. Back in my party days of the 70s. Um, oh, houses are upgrading. There's one of our houses upgraded. That looks nice. Very nice. Uh, where's another house upgrading? Oh, here. No, not there. Huh. Whatever. Ah, good. More houses being built down here. Excellent. Very good. Very nice. Let's remove a residential area from the cliff, though. New subscriber Don't want anybody building on a 90-degree angle. That's a little tough to do, no matter how good your construction company is. Mm, bum, bum, bum. All right, so our next goal will try to be to start providing all the stuff for clothing. Oh, there's the other house that's upgrading right here. Oh, it's so nice to see the houses upgrade. This is a good spot for houses. This looks really nice. Bum, 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 bum. Oh, you prefer promoting houses instead of by job level, so that way you can control the houses in different areas. That's a good idea. By that, he means, like, all the houses up here could look like this, and then all the houses down in the farming area could look like that. That's pretty, uh... That's, that's pretty uh, accurate way to do things, I think. All right, let's cut down some more trees. Since my city's always changing and getting bigger, I usually don't uh, really care too much about where things look because the city's just always spreading outwards for me. Because eventually you need a little bit more space to feed all your people with all the wheat. Hey, Daniel, thanks for being our first member. You're now a little raptor. Welcome aboard, dude. Let's get some Karens in chat. Can we get a Karen wall? Appreciate that. How long have I been playing this ham? Uh, it's been roasting since about noon. I think it's about ready we take it out of the oven. We just put a quadruple glaze member, on it. Welcome. When we take it out of the oven, it's going to be glowing like radioactivity. <clears throat> All right, let's build a... Um, I build a warehouse here. We could store all the wool from sheep. Well, actually, it might be a good idea to build a... I want to buy this territory here and make it for sheep. And then we could probably put, like, wool storage here. But I kind of want to have this area all for farming. The nice thing is, too, if we have space between these farms, I can always put, like, a little wall here. Like a little stone wall, and it'll kind of make it look like, you know, more ancient and stuff like that. It'll be kind of cool. Bum, 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 bum. Yeah, big brains. Alright, we got Karen out here fishing right now. He wants to speak to the, uh... The shark. Ooh, look at that. Happiness has plummeted. Well, actually, it's not that bad. It's just water and food, and those are being provided, though. There's water right there. We have another well right here, too. And a well there. And marketplaces here. Hmm. And religion, our churches aren't even full. 12 out of 20. Ah, I want to build another one down here, then. Let's build another one. Another one. We'll call this one the DJ Khaled Memorial Church. Actually, we could name this uh, after Daniel, our good friend. Let's see. Where could we put this church? I don't want to put it in front of the mill. And I want to save some of the homes uh, area for homes. Hmm. Can we put it right here? Uh, I think that... I forgot the name of the kingdom. It's Rune... Uh, Rune Morn. 
That was a very good name. Chat came up with pretty good, pretty big brain names for this stuff. I think we should probably put it up here. Nah, I don't want to do that either. Because if I put it up here, uh, that's going to be a mining area eventually. Uh-oh. Bad weather is coming. Uh-oh. Well, that, that's a big rip. The worst thing about bad weather in this game is when it does come, it kills your economy. Especially if you're making a lot of your money through food, which we are because we haven't started trading really. Oh boy. Uh, let's see, where do we put the church then? I want it to be used to attract more people down here, so I got an idea. Let's do this. Yep, it's going to be a big rip in our kingdom for a while. You can't really control the weather, so that's just kind of how it is. Uh, Harry's going to bed before his birthday celebration. Wow. Harry's a big boy now. Oh, you know what? Actually, if I build it over here, we could build more homes. Oh, we could actually build it over here on this side. Okay, I need a little bit more gold before we build the church, so... Uh, let's wait until we can buy new territory. There we go. And then I'll, I'll build it over here. So let's get rid of all this stuff. Um, we'll have berries down here, too. Good. Soon. Soon. Alright, cool. We'll build some homes up here, too, so this part of the town will connect. Beautiful. Play Roblox? Yeah, me and Creek Craft, Craft are playing tonight. We're, we're doing one-on-one -on -one, uh, Roblox Extreme Fortnite Challenge with Ninja. Sponsored by Coca-Cola. A division of G Fuel. You were watching me play on the uh, the Mack truck the other day. That that thing is cool. I love I love American Truck Simulator. I'm actually getting excited to play Euro Truck again because um, they're adding some uh, uh, what is it called like a global event or whatever, and uh, they're going to be building a bridge. It's going to be cool. All right, let's see if anybody happens to build any more homes down here. But we'll keep promoting people and see what happens. All right, let's take a look at happiness. Oh, water's good. So it's just basically a church now. Yeah, thanks again, boys, for the likes. Appreciate everybody smashing the like button. Uh, thanks for all the super chats and the members this week, as always. Got a lot to be thankful for with you guys, so thank you very much for helping me especially keep sane in these crazy times. Crazy. Bum, 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 bum. Hi, Raptor, I'm late. Well, you know, all can be forgiven. How do I get rid of all these markers? Oh, there they go. Oh, that's the button. Okay. Bum, 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 bum. Oh, I do like all these homes up here upgrading. Oh, some of these houses have capacity of six and just Robin is living there alone? Is that Robin Williams? Nano, nano. Oh, it is. Oh, amazing. Yeah, if anything happens with chat, YouTube's just been incredibly broke in the last few days. Well, it's really been like, it's almost a month at this point. Seems like since the beginning of May, YouTube has just been going downhill with like, I can't even see how many people are here. I can't even see how many people like. I can't I can't even see if I'm live. The only way I know I'm live is if anybody says anything in chat. My name is Karen. Uh-oh, we have a we have a Karen in chat, guys. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, Karen's here. Bum, bum. We're just waiting for... Hmm. Well, we could do more promotions, but... Yeah, we probably should. Let's do anybody who's level over level 2 can now be a resident of our city. Ooh, 
Oops, oh well. I missed. We'll try to get all of our level twos going. Oh good, we got a lot of unemployment. That means that we can start expanding our operations pretty quickly. So let's do a uh, another farm here. Wait, the farms have a really small area, don't they? I think I want to build fences between these ones then so they look cool. And then I'd like to put some, uh, maybe like, you know, cattle fields around here too, so that way the cattle can, uh, uh, be used for dairy farms. That'll be cool. Nah, maybe it's not that cool. Maybe I'm just milking it. All right, so now with the extra serfs, they'll build some houses down here, so that's good. The issue is, the biggest issue in the game is not whether or not they're building houses or who build houses. The biggest thing is when they do build a house, they have different needs, so you need to make sure that you've already built the stuff that they need before they get there. So it's like in, in the real world, sure, anybody can build a house, but if they don't have all the things they need, like a grocery store nearby and, you know, maybe like a church and a school and a police department, a fire station, a hospital, you know, like all the things that people want near them to feel safe and secure. And in this case, you definitely want to make sure you have food and water ready to go. And in fact, I think we need to build another gatherer hut here then. Yeah, the music in this game is, like, just great. Okay, let's build two uh, granaries there, or, I mean, gathering huts there. A couple people working at the market. Oh, boy, here's the storm. So here's what's going to happen. Berries and wheat are decreased by 50%, but fish increases by 20. Yeah, the only this is the only map available for the preview build, but the actual game has like, I think, five different maps. And what they're doing is they're changing it so that way all the maps will have these types of things. Like these giant rock piles where you can start mi doing mining from. Okay, so now we need to build a church. Let's actually, uh, if I build a church all the way up here, geez, I don't know if that's going to be good enough, though. I kind of want to build a church here and then maybe one down here. I just don't want to block anybody's um, home building. Well, if I if I build it here and just move the pathway over there, that okay. Let's let's build it here and we'll just move the road. That's what we'll do. Let's build it here. And then we'll build another church on the hill for another neighborhood that we're going to build here in a minute. Let's build this one out of wood. Yeah, this game is probably the first one that I can remember, aside from uh, SimCity 2013, where you could kind of, like, customize and build custom structures. And it turned out, turns out really fun when you do it that way. I like I like doing that in this game. I'm building the church into the side of the mountains. Probably not my craziest idea, but room is limited, so boom. There we go. Yeah, it's uh, the Church of Bobby. Actually, we could call it... Uh, we call it the Rousey Hill in honor of our friend. We'll name the hill after him. The Rousey Hill Rustic Church. So that'll be that neighborhood's name right there is Rousey Hill. Which is appropriate since the giant windmill is up there. Subscriber shout out. That's good. You guys have your umbrellas in chat? Guys, get some umbrellas going so that way Karen's hair doesn't get wet. Otherwise she's going to ask to uh, speak with Mother Nature's manager. Let's see. One complaint, though, is very hard to see where the border is now. 
Look at how it disappears into the grass. Like, it's impossible to see where I can and can't build. I just kind of have to imagine it. Like, I think the corner's, like, right here. Alright, let's build it over here. We'll build another church here. Build another marketplace, another... Usually that's why I like to build one large church, because building a lot of smaller churches takes up a lot of space. But in these hills, it's kind of hard to build any structure that's very large. If you've seen Norwegian structures before, when they build along the fjords and the you know, valleys and stuff in narrow area, everything, you know, they don't really have a lot of space for like a gargantuan store. Usually buildings are pretty modest. Raptoria without borders. Well, this game is all about borders. I kind of actually like it that way because the game looks a lot more... Uh, I like the way the game looks because buildings are really close together, so you get to see a lot of, like, density. Plus, people don't have cars. Nobody's going to drive to work. Like, walking anywhere more, like, close to a kilometer is a pretty long distance back in those days when you were, you know, walking anywhere. Especially if you had to carry something really heavy. Like, imagine carrying your groceries a kilometer. And they didn't have grocery bags. You had to carry your stuff back in, like, clay pots and stuff. Like, imagine walking a kilometer just to get a drink, and then you have to walk home. That's a, that's a big old distance. Ah, these farms look really good here. There's a little bit of space here. But what I can do is plant trees. Uh, so we can build a forester building over here just to kind of make it look fancy. So let's do that. Let's hire a forester for, like, a seasonal job. We'll hire some uh, teenager. Anybody ever work landscaping before? I certainly have. I used to build bridges and uh, work for landscaping. For city government and stuff like that. A lot of, a lot of good times. So it was, it was the least I was ever paid, but I was very satisfied with the job. Like, it was, uh, it was honest work. They had hemp bags? Yeah, which were transported in train cars. And back then, they had to carry the trains by hand. They didn't have locomotives. Hold on a second. That doesn't sound right, YouTuber. Uh, what am I looking for? What's it called? Forster Camp? Oh, there it is. Okay, we need to put a Forester building nearby. So I can plant some trees. You did that during your senior year of high school? Yeah, landscaping, when you're younger, it, it's a good feeling. You feel like you're, you're terraforming sometimes. You know, like if you're ever... You know, if you're doing, like, kind of a little bit more of the man maintaining landscape and you're, like, uh, for example, moving boulders or rocks around, that's when it... That's when things start to get fun. Bum, bum, bum. Bum, bum. What's up, chat? Good to see everybody here. Appreciate you all dropping by and saying hi. Or just giving me a number one in chat. Good to see that you're uh, here and... If the stream's not dead. I mean, the channel's dead, but I hope the stream's still alive. Bum, bum, bum. Bum, bum, bum. Bum, 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 bum. Bum, 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 bum. Okay, so I think I'm going to plant some trees here, and then I'll... Put down some, like, wooden fences or something. Ah, uh, what could we put here? There could be a building here. Now, uh, maybe some more trees, actually, would look nice down here. You think Chad is still bugged? Yeah, me too. God, it's weird. It's like, I want to stream, but, like... <sighs> hey, everyone, sub to my channel, because it's all about me. It's like, it's like you, YouTubing without, with stream acting weird is like driving your vehicle, but you can only drive it in first gear. Like, you can't get up to speed, and it's like, um, there should be better, better ways to do this. Uh, do trees affect the desirable areas for housing? Um, you can put down decorative trees, and if you decorate an area, yeah, if I put down decorative bushes and stuff, it, it actually will improve the, that's why there's a little green circle around it. So it'll increase the desirability. But putting down these types of trees, it does not. 
these types of trees are not affected by that. Let's make this a small road here. Okay, that'll be fine. Bum, 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 bum. Ooh, look at the harvest going on. Bum, 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 bum. Yep, Twitch links are down below. Although I don't stream there because most of our audience is here. Wow, people are already attending the church and it's not even built. It's already like half full. Almost. Alright, so I'll probably build a well up here too. I'll wait till everything gets done. Yeah, I'll probably do some sheep up here too by the church. Although I need to make sure my people have housing. But it seems like the biggest problem right now is the church, but they're building one. Bum, bum. Starting a new game? Nope. New subscriber shout -out. We're continuing on from our stream yesterday. Where were you, Sean? Did you see our video? Make sure you always turn on that notification bell, guys, so you don't miss out on streams. Because we played this one for a long time yesterday. Bum, 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 bum. It's looking good, though. Although I'm... I will say that seeing the huts in the hills looks a little weird. These houses look a little better. Hopefully everybody upgrades soon enough. Alright, so the next thing to start selling in order to increase our cash will have to be clothing. So before we build sheep, I'm going to start building some uh, weaver's huts and things like that for them. Doesn't look like anybody's building up here anymore. But I could leave some of the space for them. Also, when we, um, when we find another rock pile, I will move that mine. Here's a good spot to build some of the weavers and such. Although I feel I should build more warehouses up here. This is where all the people are going to be. Hmm. Oh boy, here comes another envoy. Is this done now? Re. Okay, let's see. Um, I want to build some weaver's huts, but I just don't want it to be so close to the other town. Oh, you got reassigned, so now I'm uh, streaming during a different time for you? Very cool. Yeah, we could actually build a bridge across here to the other town. Oh, this is perfect. Ooh. This is a good opportunity to build a... Uh, a bridge across to that town, and then we could actually uh, easily ship the uh, wool into the town here. Perfect. Alright, before we do anything else, let's assign, now that these are done. are good. Bum, 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 bum. And we will have to build a granary down here so supplies aren't so far away and so that way the 
mill has some extra supply. New subscriber shout out. Uh, Will, thanks for seven. Okay, I'm gonna get rid of this lumber camp. Yep, all the information is down below in the description for dino dollars and points and things like that. So make sure you read the description in its entirety. There's a lot of info there, but a lot of time to read it, too. Yeah, you can eventually buy the whole map. I don't think it's limited in any way. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to build this here. So that way we can store wheat, flour, and then berries for this marketplace here. And then an eventual one over here as soon as they're done building the church. Australian truck driving game coming to consoles? That'd be the first I heard of it. Hopefully soon. Wow, let's build another wooden bridge. This one's gonna be expansive. Woo, 225 planks. Jeez, this is like building railroad bridges in the Wild West. There we go. <laughs> How read. <laughs> well, brain have to be XL. Can anyone in chat borrow a big brain to somebody? Okay, let's build a bridge here. This is cool. I like this. So now we can put sheep and stuff up here. I can put, like, the town at the bottom, all the sheep at the top, and then uh, we can ship things off over here. Uh, we can build weavers and stuff over here. But this is usually how this game goes, where you have to build more and more... Uh, you have to build, like, a whole production line before you can really turn it on. So we probably have a lot of unemployed, but... If you think about it, once I build two weaver huts and, like, two tailors and stuff, it'll take up all those unemployed. Yeah, customization in this game is amazing. I kind of want to build another Lord's Manor. We're at our maximum again. Oh, I was going to edit my Lord's Manor now, wasn't I? I need to have a room in the back for parties and for all of our lovely members. We build the, build our members' room over here for members to have a party. Oh, this will be like our little shed for maintaining the, uh, the estate. Yes, of course. Let's see if we can build a little... Oh, that looks nice. Bum, bum. Hmm. Maybe I could build another... Oh, boy. A building on top of a build... Oh, boy. Um, I got an idea. Let's do this instead. Let's build this here. It's 3 a.m. in Moscow, but it's totally worth it to be up. Yeah, if you're watching this game, for sure. This game's a lot of fun. But don't blame me if you get in trouble for being up late. It's not... It's not my... Not my... No, I didn't do it. Look at how cool it is, like, customizing buildings in this game. It's just awesome. Well, you can kind of see the window there, but... Jeez, now it... Now it looks like a house within a house. But I guess that'll be our tax office out back. Let's add another... Actually, maybe we could connect the whole thing through. Oh, that looks neat. Wow, you can you can tell Raptor's doing really good at streaming. We must have got a few more Raptor Ultimate members. We're adding an entire new addition onto the house. <laughs> you can you can see when it happened. We must have got a new member right here around this point of the stream. That's all right, David. We're here to keep you company, and we're glad you're here. In fact, might I say? We're lucky that you're here. Let's put some banners out front. Oh, we don't have uh, fabric yet to really do a lot of that. Can we build this a little taller?
Oh, that looks really nice, boys. Check that out. Awesome. Beautiful. Powell Manor is looking really nice. All right, I think that's good. I think we should stick with that one. And we'll turn each one of those... Uh... Thank you. Yes. Thank you. <laughs> we'll turn every one of those rooms into a treasury. So that way we can hold even more of people's money. So we can keep it safe from them. For their safety. Can't let them get it. They'll spend it wrong. It's better in our hands. Bum, bum, bum. Wow, some of you guys really stay up late to watch me. Usually I stream around this time because it's like at the end of my day of making videos and doing other stuff, this is just this is just me hanging out. Bum. We can always expand the gardens later. That's true. Well, we don't have a lot of room, but I could probably take that area. But well, we got a lot of builders running around now building all sorts of stuff. They're building the bridge, they're building the church. They're building the new granary. Now, where can we put our weaver's huts? I think people actually like to live next to weaver's huts because they... They kind of look like nice buildings and they're rather quiet compared to others. Um. Ah, time for a sip. Men of War Assault Squad 2. Oh, it's old and clunky and inefficient, and World War II content gets suppressed by YouTube, and... It's getting harder and harder to play that game as time goes on, just because it's unstable and hard to get multiplayer going and stuff. Maybe one day. Uh, epic loot from um, difficult missions? Yeah, if you take the... Um, the extremely difficult missions a few times. Eventually you'll get um, blueprints and uh, jewels. and Oh, they also bring in a lot of money too, which is a big reason why you want to build Lord's Manor's really big. Because once you start going on military campaigns, you're going to need a place to store all that money. Oh boy, what do I... I kind of wanted to build the tavern here, but actually we could do more sheep up here too. Oh. Uh, a guy has given me five dollars, saying, uh, enjoy the vibe you give. Well, thank you for enjoying my vibe. And I will enjoy a, uh, McDonald's Happy Meal with your five. Thank you very much. Ah, finally! The the bad weather is gone. Excellent. Well, we're, make, if you, we're making a lot of money now, but now we're going to make even more now that the food is going to be flowing again into the kingdom. I think we're going to buy this hill up here, and we'll do sheep up here. Wow. Cause, yeah, because there's not really... Or do I want to do a Lord's Manor up there? Oh, I don't know. We, we'll need to do another Lord's Manor up there, I think. As a matter of fact, that's exactly what we're going to do. Thank you, Chad. I appreciate that. I'll be here all night. Thank you. Man. Okay. Okay, so let's do this. I'll turn this area into another town. We'll build yet another... Uh, marketplace and well over there. Maybe it could be used for farming. We'll have to promote some more serfs, though. Promoting people to serfs, though, does take a while, because before you promote them, you should wait at least till they have a couple levels of experience. That way they can do their jobs better and actually, per you know, give more to the town than they take out. Although, every time people... Like, existence isn't free. Keep that in mind, kids. Meaning that when they buy a food, they have to pay for it, but water's free. Okay, let's see if we can build a road that goes up this way, maybe? Alright, I'm gonna build my private residence up here. Uh, to keep me... I mean, to keep you guys safe, all of you, uh... I believe this is where all the subscribers and members and stuff live down here. Bad weather never ends in Britain? Oh, for real, John? Eh, Brits every once in a while tell me they see the sun a few times a year. When they're allowed. Alright, this is getting really good now. Now we're really starting to get into this game. Let's start painting territory for the residential home. Eh, we'll wait until they're done cutting that all down. And the bridge is almost done too. It's kind of weird. I think this part's glitched. Like, the bridge... According to this, the bridge is done building. But... Like, they're still building it. Like, they're using the bridge... 
They're like walking under the bridge, but the bridge is not... Yeah, it's weird. Alright, let's do... Uh... Let's see, we got 13 for the kingdom. I think I'll probably do some for the clergy. Yay. Bum, bum. Bum, bum, bum. Bum, bum. Yeah, I'll probably get some more keys to this game, so if you want a chance to win, make sure you click or tap that join button, because the developers will be sending me keys soon for Foundation. So if you win tonight, I can give you a couple of different prizes tonight, or if you wait a little bit, I will give you some keys to this game. Okay, so let's not let anybody build a house down here anymore. We'll just keep this valley nice and quiet. It's kind of pretty. Like me. Alright, then we'll hire somebody to work at the... Forester camp. As soon as they plant, we'll start doing all that stuff. Uh, priests don't need to be assigned at all. Churches work automatically. There's no way to... There's no way to assign priests. I wish they would remove that. Everybody always comments that. Like, you don't have priests assigned, but... Churches basically work like a well. When people are in need of religion, they just li they literally walk into the church and then they walk out and it's replenished. But there can only be so many people like assigned to the church at a time. Wow, there's a lot of there's like a yearly like pilgrimage down to the bottom of the hill. Where they then start farming. Okay, as soon as they're done, I'll plant all the stuff here. Yeah, it's like getting gas for your car. Like, they they drive and they commute all week with the power of Jesus, and then at the end of the week they have to they have to swing by the, uh, the blue planet. Okay. So we'll build another Lord's Manor there once we start hitting the top end of money. Oh, thanks, Little Red. Appreciate that. Uh, you guys are so positive and stuff. I appreciate that the most. For those of you guys who can't drop Super Chats or can't become members, but you're a subscriber and you're a big fan, you are just as meaningful to me as somebody who's like a long-time, big-o, ultimate member who drops Super Chats all the time. Just, just the same as somebody who's here all the time watching. So I appreciate that. Positivity, though. That's the, like, you can't buy that. That's something that you gotta kind of, like, plant and grow. Bringing people together is hard. And finding the common good is a real search. Bum, 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 bum. Um, okay, I think we better start building weaver's huts, but I think I'm only going to be able to build a couple just to limited space. Let's build one there. And we'll build a tailor on the other side of town. Alright, there we go. And then... We will start sheepy sheepy over here somewhere. Promotions are available again, good. Let's upgrade our people. Let's see, anybody level 2? do too many upgrades just yet. Take her easy until we got clothing supplied. Cool. Cool. Oh, yes, yeah, so and now we can start planting trees. So we'll plant some pine trees here. This little 
area here. I could put something here, but I don't know what. I could keep it open for like a ch cheese, like a little dairy cheese thing, and then build a... Could put cows down there or something like that. Oh, good. Another home being built. Also, when you do, uh, when you upgrade people, when you promote people, make sure that your builders are pretty much free, too, because if you, um, have a bunch of construction projects going on, people are just going to be really upset about, like, not having a home forever. It's going to take a long time. Bum, bum, bum. Yeah, I think we're going to build a manor up here. So this can be, uh, Chat's house, I guess. Oh, that's why they're not building it. It's in Forbidden Land. That makes sense. There we go. Builders should be able to get in there now and start doing their job. Richard Denton is now a little raptor. Welcome back, dude. I see you were a supporter before. Welcome back again. Greatly appreciate that. All right, so we'll extend the forest out here. And then I'll figure out something to build down there. Now, if you have any problems in the chat, just go ahead and refresh. YouTube's getting ridiculous. Making it hard for people to subscribe and all that stuff. If, if you're watching now and you can hear, hear me, make sure you subscribe and turn on that notification bell because who knows what's going on with YouTube. It's really weird. I just don't want you guys to miss out on the stream. So don't forget to turn that on. Actually, we'll leave this alone here. And we'll just cut down trees in this area. Good, good. How much is this game? Well, it'll be free if we get to 15 new members tonight. I will do some giveaways for members. But I believe it's close to 30 bucks on Steam. Just make sure you uh, check... Steam for the availability in your currency, or it could go on uh, sale as well. Bill with the five Dino Man Foundation stream. Guess the world's gonna be okay. Yeah, we're back again. We streamed it yesterday. Now we're back for more. Builders need to bring 36 planks and 25 stone. But I'm assuming they're also busy building other houses now, too. A lot of stuff being built. Well, it's going to take a little bit of time. Wow. I know. Hey, Nathan, thanks for the dollar, dude. Appreciate that support. And Rhino Master, thanks for becoming a Raptor Hatchling. Appreciate that level of support. You guys are awesome. New subscriber shout out. Beautiful. Uh, ten from Tar Tar a Teamer. Really appreciate your videos, stream, and cool positive vibe. Well, thank you. I appreciate your support. Wow. I'm gonna need a bigger treasury now for all your guys' support. We I gotta build a new uh, manor. Yeah, hopefully somebody comes over with the required materials for this soon. Oh, we can select a mandate now. Uh, let's see. Give support to... Go labor. Man, YouTube chat is just completely broken. Yeah, I, I see you guys... All you guys are having problems. I see that. That's That sucks. Why did... Why... How... How does a billion dollar company have difficulty with chat for like the multitude of like four weeks? How do, how do you goof that up? 
I could understand like an hour, a couple hours, maybe a day even, but... Man. They're still building this bridge, by the way. That's what's taking so long. Good work on trimming the beard. Thank you. It was hard, but... I watched an instructional video called uh, Jumanji with Robin Williams, and he showed me how to how to really cut back. So you guys got to keep refreshing to see chat, man. Now, well, welcome, welcome to my hell, boys. Yeah, it's Karen. Karen, I think, wanted to speak with chat's manager, and so now. Chat is broken. Let's actually build like a little. St oh, I can't build a stone wall yet. But I can build one of these walls. Or a fence, at least. Yep, Karen wanted to speak with YouTube's manager. Shut it down. Yeah, I can't even see how many people are watching. You guys can't even see chat. What did. Usually I'm pretty patient and I don't mind stuff, but this is this has been a month long, like continuously getting worse. Like how do you how do you do that? How do you have thousands of employees? How about you take some people away from the censorship team? You know, one or two of those four hundred thousand people and uh, have them make it work. How about that? Oh, freedom of speech alert! Uh oh. Somebody said Taiwan. Uh-oh. We're so sorry. CCP, I'm sorry! Calm down, Susan. Jesus. How uh -huh. dare you speak to me that way, YouTuber? Hurt feeling police are on the way! You know what our next Karen emote has to be? It has to be Karen, the Karen haircut, but on top of the YouTube loco. That's what we gotta do. That would be good. All right, looks like a lot of buildings are being built, so we better chill for a little bit. The bridge is still constructing, and I see homes are under construction, too. It looks like at least one, two, three here, plus the weaver, plus maybe another home here. Anon said a lot of free services would be disrupted because evil people are using these. Yeah. Yeah, YouTube chat is where all... Where all... All that stuff is planned. Jeez, re. Oh, well. I'm just, get, I'm just getting frustrated on behalf of you guys now because it's like... I'm streaming because I want to chat with you guys, but half of chat is just saying, can anyone read chat? I can see your guys' chat. Give, give me a one in chat. I need your power, your energy. Okay, more promotions available. But I think we're going to stay put for a little bit. Until we have some more stuff unlocked. Initiating members only mode. Initiating members only mode. Initiating members only mode. I do members only mode, Phil, but I don't even know if like half the people can actually like see their own chat. I will, I will activate it towards the end of the stream. Please don't let me forget. YouTuber, when is the Fortnite stream? But since we're having chat problems, I want to wait a little bit. But I will do it. Okay. Bum, 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 bum. Dang it. Oh, look at that. 47. Oh, there's 50 flowers stored there? All right, we need another bakery, too. However, the bakery's made 400, almost 300-something uh, of that as well. Discord, thanks for upgrading to a raptor hatchling. You're a longtime supporter, too. Thank you very much. Let's check. We have two builders. No, we have, yeah, we have two builders' offices. Fully staffed now. There we go. That might have explained some of the slow building. Are they using this bridge yet? I can't tell. Oh, there it is. Now it's constructed. 
All right, the final wooden bridge is done. Let's wait till all the construction is complete so that way I don't uh, overstretch our workers. We'll let them build houses and a few other things. This looks nice. Oh my. All right, we're storing a lot of logs up there, too. Cool. Looks like there's a few more trees to cut down over here in this neighborhood. When is Billy going to bed? Whenever Karen asks to speak with his manager. Billy's mother is Karen, but if Karen had to speak to the manager for her child's behavior, she'd have something called uh, self-accountability, and that would be like dividing by zero. You remember the old divide by zero memes from like 2000, like the early 2000s? What's up, Vert World? Thank you very much for becoming a member. Appreciate that. And Phil, thanks for your upgrade as well. Yeah, some of these houses are halfway into the ground, yeah. But that's what happens when you build on a hill. Houses still have to be flat, so one side has to be, like, Welcome. almost halfway into the ground. Oh, good. And they're starting to uh, complete our new... Uh, let's actually watch the Lord's Manor be constructed. Let's watch. Beautiful. Majestic. Ba -da -ba -ba -ba. Did I hear about QAnon? Uh, no. Is that, a, is that another rapper that's popular with today's youth? Oh good, now we can turn these into treasuries. Beautiful now. Now we can store 1,300 gold. Nope. Now we can store 1,500 gold. Beautiful. Beautiful. QAnon is a revolution, a world of free of suffering. The only thing free is the peanuts that you get at the Texas Roadhouse. Everything else you gotta pay for. Well, except for this channel. No, you still have to pay attention. Yeah. You certainly do. Did I ever play SAS Zombie Assault TD? Well, if I did, it's probably on the channel, but it doesn't sound familiar. So I'd have to say probably not. All right, so we're going to build another Lord's Manor up here. So I could probably end up building um, something else up here. Actually, we could build a giant Lord's Manor up here. That'd be cool. So if we need to expand our manor anymore, we'll build another one up there. And then any more homes can be constructed down here. So let's build a well. Okay, I've done that twice now. There we go. Free refills? Yeah, okay, fair enough. Yeah, but only in America. Europe Europe don't play that. <coughs> Are smiles still free at McDonald's? Um I don't know. I'm getting tired of uh, ba da ba ba ba. I'm loving it though. Like that's been their slogan for almost 20 years. I miss. Did somebody say McDonald's? Or have you had your break today? Or we love to see you smile. Like all that stuff. I miss all that stuff. Wow, more homes being constructed. That's great. Another well being built there, then.
I have to put the sheep somewhere, though. Actually, we could buy this territory and put sheep nearby. Where's the beef? Wendy's FTW? That's my boy. Yeah, Wendy's for the win. McDonald's used to put free smiles as a menu item back in the 80s. Cringe. That's kind of obnoxious, like when you go to Jimmy John's, and if you've ever gone into a Jimmy John's, there'll be, like, the thing on the on the wall that says, like, free smells or whatever, and it's like, you win this round, Jimmy John's, but I'll get you next time. I'll get you in the next round. Yeah, I miss Dave Thomas, too. Like, he was... There's no, there's no dudes or... Like, there's no OGs left. Like, Colonel Sanders was dead and just basically turned into a... You know, just a corporation, basically. Dave is dead. The passion went out of it, man. When there's profit to be had. Gotta get that passion and care out of the way so we can make more money. Yeah, if you think about it, like, it's really only, like, Dave Thomas and, like, um... Like, there's, there was no Burger King. Like, there was no no dude or lady or anything named, like, you know, Teresa King or something like that who was the CEO of Burger King. Can't remember the last time he had KFC? Probably over a decade? Yeah. Seems, seems right. I haven't gone to a KFC in a million years. No, they're just not what they used to be. Are they using the bridge? Uh, nobody's really coming over here yet. But they will if I start putting sheep nearby. Oh, somebody built a house right there? Jeez. Oh, well. I want to put a sheep farm over here, but I probably will buy the land over this way. actually put a sheep farm here. Let's do that. We'll build a few sheep farms over here. Ah, perfect. We'll leave this land to the sheep. There we go. Bum, 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 bum. Alright, we'll have to another, build another bakery soon, too. Okay, we'll assign some tailors once we got all that going, and then we'll actually have to start building uh, onto the marketplaces, too, so we can start selling clothing. Well, let's build ourselves a goods stall. And we have three markets now. Speaking of markets, you guys know the other uh, chicken place that's actually kind of good? It's, I'd say it's probably closer to the, uh, to KFC. Boston Market, dude. That place was good, although there's not very many of them. And I can't remember the last time I went there, but... Yeah, you can put up each individual stall in a marketplace. And so, like, you can always move a market. It's it's kind of hard to put these markets down, though, on a, on a mountain. Because there's no real good flat spot to put it down. Church's chicken? Yeah, each one of these uh, buildings is a church's chicken. We have a fast food haven here. Bum, bum. Thanks for dropping by, Daniel. Appreciate your support. 
Welcome to all you new subs this week. If you guys are new here, welcome aboard. Thanks for uh, subbing. Appreciate that. If you're watching now, your name should pop up on the screen if you do subscribe, so thanks for doing that. Welcome to all the new members, too, and thanks for uh, supporting. Alright, so it looks like a lot of people want to build homes. Makes sense. Let's do this. Good, all the sheep farms are being built. Great. Yeah, desirability should increase here when we get a few other homes built. They're probably building houses elsewhere. A few more did get built over here. Bum, 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 bum. What game is this? Fortnite 5. Yep, you can go out on battles. Game has uh, militaries that you can build and all sorts of stuff like that. Alright, David, thanks for being here, dude. We love having you here. Thank you. Alright, so now we're going to start building clothes. Yeah, super exciting. <laughs> Takes a while for these buildings to get constructed. But looks like they're doing them now. You love Anno 1800? Good. Well, you're going to love uh, Industries of Titan tomorrow. That'll get an update. And finally, we can build ourselves roads, which will have cars in the game. That'll be cute. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Oh. You're saving to become a member? Awesome. Well, thank you for the uh, the need, the uh, the desire to support, the the feeling, the want. Appreciate that. Well, hopefully we can see you click or tap that join button soon, and then you can be one of us. Oh, that's what we need to get. Is our next emote should be the one of us emote. That'll be fun. But right now, all we got is Karen. We just have Karen right now. Bum, 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 bum. Yeah, the first person update to Cloudpunk's really cool. I really wish more people would watch those videos. Is that the 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 way that world looks is just so cool. It's like I kind of just want there to be a free play mode where I can drive around. I guess technically you could do that at any time by just not following your uh, missions or anything for a little bit. Not like you'd get in trouble for it. All right, I'm not going to assign clothes yet until we've got sheep farms going. Looks like we got two of them ready. New subscriber shout out. <sighs> yeah. No, thanks for uh, subscribing. What's the age limit for becoming a member? Uh, newborn. Bum, 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 bum. Oh, Envoy is here again. So I don't know if I need to really speak with him. Uh, eh. Now we need to get to Commodores first. Bum, 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 bum. Bum.
Uh, Clark, you can find out more details about this game on Steam. Okay, so that's going to be our fourth little uh, sheep farm. I love building out in these hills. It feels more rural that way. Also, our town is kind of defended being up on the hill like that. Once we start selling clothing, we'll be making a lot of money again. And then we'll be making fabric, which means we can make more dummies for our training. And then finally we can start sending out some uh, troops on military campaigns. Any threat of invasion? Um, only threat of invasion from uh, newcomers. No, that's a lot of damage. Yeah, got him. Okay, I think I'm gonna just get some more people working first before we assign everybody to. Probably should build two tailors and two weavers. We'll do a weaver here. Yeah, there might be more of a military update in the future where you can command troops, uh, like in battle. But it doesn't have any of that just yet. Soon. Soon. Subscriber shout out. All right, good. Let's wait a little bit for more things to be constructed. And hopefully people come across this bridge. This bridge will probably only be used when somebody brings wool into town. However, people who build houses here could go across to this marketplace, but we'll see. <laughs> What do you do with Dino Dollars? Make sure you check in the description so you can see all the information about our stream so you know where to spend sound effects and stuff. How do I use Dino Dollars? Check down below in the description. That's right. Okay, let's see. So we're out of money again, but it should come in as soon as we've got clothing being sold, and it looks like we're making some. What does unemployment look like now? Just four. Not bad. Good. Good. Are you late? You were watching Netflix? Wh what? Netflix can wait. Well, apparently somebody wasn't selling berries there. Let's try to get all the jobs going. I really need to fix these menus so that way I can actually, like, scroll down. 
Alright, looks like we need more people in the city before we can assign all the jobs, so now we just play the waiting game to get more labor. How does one gain dino dollars? Check in the description. Everybody watching right now, look below the video. There's a section down there called the description. In the description is information for all sorts of frequently asked questions that we get asked probably every two to three minutes in every single stream since we started streaming. So do me a big O favor. Everybody look down below, open that up, and every question that you have a question about will be answered down there, I guarantee it. And if you have any other questions, drop a big O super chat, and I'll be sure to answer it as well if it wasn't answered down there as well. For a chance to support the stream. What's the name of this game, you ask? Well, be sure to read the title in its entirety, and I'll answer your question directly. Plus, you'll get dino dollars in oh, order you're looking to... to join. There you go. Excellent. Click or tap the join button next to the subscribe button now. Spend on those sound effects and such. Half How the... do I use dino dollars? <laughs> Check Half down the sound below effects in the description. Like, literally, people... Like, become members and stuff to use those sound effects to tell other people to just read the description. Like, every stream is just like... I'm not even playing a game, it's more of just like a description awareness. Every day in the Raptorian calendar is just a description awareness day. Make sure you open up that description, boys. It's down there. I promise. Wow. Members only mode? Uh, maybe towards the end. This chat was being really weird. I I didn't know if anybody could see messages, so... But yeah, we'll have to do it at some point. Yes, we will. Um, yep, that's that's big brain mode. How dare you speak to me that way, YouTuber? Hurt feeling police are on the way! Yeah, and some people get that way too when you tell them. Um, but it's the truth. That's why I typed it all out, so that way everyone has a chance to read it. Uh, members only mode is members only mode. Oh my god, mom made pizza rolls! But we turn it on for five minutes just for our members, and you'll hardly notice it. Our giveaways for, are for members only as well. Just provides a little extra reward for those who go a little extra and support the channel more than they need to. Okay, so now we just need to wait a little bit for more people to move into the city so I can assign them jobs. So right now we have... 89 people, two on employment. Good. We'll assign somebody to a weaver. And the granaries and warehouses I'll leave alone. Okay. Cute idea to do a raptor with sunglasses. Oh, that'd be a good emote idea. If anybody wants to draw one, drop it on the Discord. And I'll use it as an emote. Yeah, we'll go into members only mode soon, I promise. But since chat's being a little weird with YouTube being broken and me not knowing what's going on, I just want to observe from afar. But I'll do it. All right, so eventually we're going to need to train soldiers, but in order to do that, we have to import weapons. So let's do that first. And we'll start with a group of... 15... 15 troops should be a good start. We'll need to get our population high enough so that way we can actually have those people support. Typical Ragnarok, thanks for the big old 20 Swedish kroner. Tax and make it. Welcome and compass. How am I do, young man, bro? Tax and make it. Sheep farmers are going around because the bridge is blocked. Okay, let's fix the bridge then. Or, they're going around because it might actually be shorter for them to go that way too. But sometimes I don't know if the game actually does it by route, or if it does it by... Re... Sir? I had this problem in Austria, too, where people will walk around the bridge. If it doesn't work, don't tell anybody. It'll look nice, at least. Yeah, we'll, we'll see as soon as more people come through. Alright, boys, we're almost up to the big 300 on likes. If you want to see more of this game, make sure you smash that like button so I know, so I can bring her back. 
great way to support the stream and keeps me motivated. What's up, Goody? Okay, let's see. So now we've got pretty much to wait for promotions, I suppose, for more house building. And get more of that money, y'all. Oh, here comes the envoy again. I think we'll actually extend the military camp, too, so we can build a big training zone. on the Discord with the link in the description to suggest some games. Check the description down below for a schedule of live streams and upcoming videos. This house might actually be blocking it, but I think they can sneak by. Oh yeah, they extended their house. Actually, this gives me room to build over here now. Let's build a well over here. Oh good, they're building their house over there now. Oh yeah, the house was in the way. That's what it was. Alright, now people are taking the bridge. Although they're not many yet, but... Soon. Soon. Bum, 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 bum. Yeah, I'm going to use this area here because it's nice and flat for training. Or at least the mo kind of flat. What I'll need to do is build more training dummies so we can actually train our army a little bit more. And then we'll also have to um, get a lot, uh, just a lot bigger population now. Because this is the part in the game where, sure, you can build pretty much anything you want. But all these people here, all these unemployed, are going to become soldiers. And I'm going to need about 15 of them, so it's going to be a little bit of time. So let's extend the military camp here. Good. All right, that looks good. Bom, bom, yes. bom, 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 bom. Well, I'm glad you agree, Colt. Good. You don't see a warehouse for fish? Fish is stored up here at the granary. But I could also do it here. No, we're already storing that there, too. Probably should store the rest of our flour here, too. Because the uh, windmill's getting awfully full. Wow, it looks like one windmill can support... Like five different fa four farms there. That's crazy. Yeah, this game's a little cartoony, but it's really, it's really minimal. Like the people look a little funny, but they're they're quite believable actually. All right, let's prepare the military camp for troops. Once we start deploying our people on uh, military missions, then we start to gain a lot of money and notoriety. When we build these buildings, we can actually use these for uh, treasury buildings, too. Hmm. I 
There we go. Alright. Then we'll start training our military as soon as that's done. So we have... How many people available for troops? Oh, nice. That's a good start, but we need more. More. Uh, you're the general of the army. Uh, next, next person to become a Raptor Ultimate member. And we're going to throw her into members only mode while we wait. Thank you. I'm, I'm glad you agree. All right, let's throw her into members only mode. Bum, 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 bum. There we go, a little personal time with the members. Ah, more people are arriving in the kingdom. Good. Oh, we gotta deliver fish. Wait a minute. 20 days to deliver... F or 45 days to deliver 20 fish. We have... F oh, wow, they ate all the fish. Holy crap. Hi, members. Welcome back to you all. How are things? In this fine kingdom? Good. Great. There's no other option for them to be anything else, so I'm glad you agree. Wonderful. Perfect. Great. Awesome. What game is this? Okay. Who was that? Who asked that? Who was that? What am I looking for? Fisher's Hut. Yeah, it's weird how they call it a Fisher's Hut. Like, Fishing Dock, I think that'd be fine. Fine name for it. Oh my god, Mom made pizza rolls! Pizza roll time. Okay, two Fisher's Hi, Hut. Hi, Chad. Billy Nelson here, and you're lucky I'm here. Wow, you guys get to go into members-only mode, and then you become a bunch of Billies. Chat, I, tr I trusted you, chat. I trusted you. Okay, let's see. Oh, yep, the bridge is being used. People walking across it. Beautiful. And it looks like those people built their house over here. No problem. Cool. How dare you speak to me that way, YouTuber? Hurt feeling police are on the way. Calm down, Karen. It's okay. Everything's all right. We're making some decent change now, but it needs to increase quite quickly. Uh-oh, creeper. Ooh, a Minecraft mod for this game would be cool. All the buildings look like Minecraft style. Oh my god, this YouTuber needs to mean? go to jail. Cops are on the way, guys. Don't worry. Oh my god. Can I get a shout out? Be sure to click or tap subscribe or become a member today. Wow. Hey everyone, sub to my channel because it's all about me. I didn't realize I could be so annoying. <laughs> okay, let's see. Br uh, bread is being delivered here. Wow, they're holding a hundo bread down there? Jeez. And 99 bread here too. Oh, we God, need to this trade. This YouTuber sucks. Mom, where's my hot pocket? Hey, welcome again to all the new uh, subscribers. Appreciate you guys. Thank you very much for clicking and tapping that subscribe button. I'm going to start selling everything that I can now. We can get, get some more money going. Oh, we God, are... This YouTuber sucks. Oh. Mom, where's my hot pocket? We have 15 now. We have 15 weapons. Perfect. Okay, two people, zero joined, okay. What's our population? 98. Bum, bum. Bum, 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 bum. Oh, good. Look at all the people we can make into military troops now. Yeah, we'll let six people stay at the site. Okay, let's do... Okay, we have ten people assigned. And they're just going to be fist fighting, I guess. Alright, let's assign our troops some weapons. Okay, we only have five swords, so you guys are going to have to share when you go into battle, okay? going to be interesting. 
I thought we had 15 weapons. I guess we need to buy more. We're probably out of cash. Right, Billy? How do I use dino dollars? Check down below in the description. Oh, I just took the sip. It counted. How much to make me pick pick my nose? Five hundred dollar super chat, dude. Two five hundos. All right, so now we just gotta wait for Dang more weapons it. to arrive. I know, I know, but that's just the way it is. Bom, 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 bom. Where's Boo? I don't know. King Boo, are you here? Boo's probably watching like Colt and stuff now. He, he's betrayed me. He used to be cool. What happened, man? I don't know. He just went off to support other people too. That's cool. Oh my God! Mom made pizza rolls. They'll always come back. Okay, we've got 10 people training here. Yeah, I need five more people to come into the city so we can get an army of 15. Oh, good. Two more are coming. Excellent. Bum, 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 bum. Hmm. Let's see. How do I use dino dollars? Check down below in the description. Do, 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 do. Two more people have decided to join the kingdom. So when we go on our first military conquest, we'll bring back some cash, and then we can put that cash into building um, or upgrading more serfs and commoners, so that way we can get some more homes. That's why military conquests help out. They bring in some good cash. Thanks, Phil. This is a nice little road. New subscriber shout out. Wow. Are these like... Apparently there's no clothing reserved. Might need to build another warehouse. Okay, so let's see. Now we can buy... Oh, wait. I can trade with everybody now. Cool. That'll help trade. Um, I could sell berries, but... Eh, I think everything's good for now, so we'll just let it sit. Happiness is at 98. And now we'll just kind of, like, wait until we get a little bit more cash so we can upgrade people. But that'll probably wait until we go on a military conquest, and that'll wait till we're done with trade. What else could I trade away? Eh, all right, I guess we'll have to do food after all, because money is, money is good. Let's just sell all the bread... All the berries and then fish. Yep, town happiness is at 96 and uh, population's at 100. And we'll just have to upgrade some more people. Looks like money's coming in now. And let's assign some more military personnel. We'll wait till we get to 15 military and then also 15 weapons. Bum, 
Bum, bum, bum. Let's store clothes. Fabric and wool. Very good. All right, welcome again to all the new subscribers, too. Appreciate everybody subbing. If you haven't already, now's a great time. Appreciate everybody tuning in. Thanks for all the likes. Welcome to new members, too. Appreciate that. Hopefully you're all enjoying everything. Bum. Bum, bum. All right, more people are joining the kingdom. Good. Soon. Soon. Sun. Sun. Sown. Sown. Sip. Sip. Okay, time for a sip, boys. Do 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 do. Bum bum bum. Bum 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 bum. Do I like Star Wars? Yeah, my favorite's probably uh, John Luke Picard. Of the uh, Millennium uh, Death Star. Dang it! Thank you. Bum, bum, bum. Yeah, Heiser just turned off for now, for a while. This chat was getting too spammy, and I couldn't really like. It was getting harder and harder between the billies and the chat uh, automated messages and stuff. It was getting a little, little much. Oh, this is our second episode we played yesterday. How much uh, stuff do we have coming in? We have 161 wool. Tons of fabric. Tons of clothing. Alright, good. We just need somebody to work at the other warehouses then. Get two people transporting that stuff. Jeez, I don't have any more... Weapons? Where's my Where's my weapons, boys? Where's like, someone get my nine? Buy to fifteen swords. Can I buy spears? No, we can't buy those yet. Only sell, I think. Stockpile shows we have zero, so we just gotta wait then. Can't send anybody out on a military quest until they're all we fully armed and fully trained. A demon faint. Don't copy paste, dude. Just watch the stream. You'll be able to make that assertion by kind of watching and seeing what happens on the screen. What I would recommend is clicking the subscribe button and turning on that notification bell and watching all of our other videos and stuff too. You'll get access to some mediocre at best content and then you can see those other games on the channel as well. And then you'll be able to compare like the differences between them and things that you do and can't do and whatnot. Well, we're literally playing the game right now, so any questions about the game can be answered by just kind of watching the stream. Been there, done that? Oh, then you should know exactly the differences between all features of all games you mentioned twice. Michael Schmidt, thank you for becoming a Raptor Egg. Welcome aboard. Appreciate that. Thank you very much for being here. Welcome. Let's get some Karens in chat for our lovely new member. New member, welcome. Oh, it looks like we're not cutting down any more trees either. Not that we needed any more logs, but I'll probably start exporting those. Actually, I think we were selling logs. Jeez. Come on, boys. We need some more swords. I need some more swords. Okay, now we got 15 troops. That's what I wanted. And now we'll just have to trade for more weapons. Oh, and we're at our maximum again, too. 
Well. We could build another manor up here. This is a weird one to buy, though, because I'm going to have to buy two places. Oh, that's annoying. Uh, blueprints can be studied in the bailiff's office, and then you can unlock things like the Roman church. We did that in our uh, previous episode of Raptoria. Okay, let's see. Uh, everything's looking pretty good here. Oh, I forgot all about that quest. Oh, well. It not really make, make a difference, really. Just need to get swords. Sw swords. Subles. New subscriber shout out. Oh, you know what? I think we're not getting them because I need a place to store them. That might be why. That might be good. There we go. Uh, that's okay. We'll buy both sides of this mountain. It'll be fine. Plus, we're about to bring in a lot of cash now. When you start going on a military missions, what you want to do at the start is have your units work in big groups so that way they can get XP. And then once they get high enough XP, what you want to do is then split them into, like, if you have two groups of ten... No, that's a lot of damage! You can have them go out on two different quests, and then they'll just bring in tons and tons of money. But if you're going to do that, make sure you have, like, a... You might need to build, like, a gargantuan, like, palace in order to switch enough of buildings to, uh... Uh... To treasuries in order to hold all the gold you're about to make. But I think we might want to start with that, because we're, we're pretty much at our maximum again. Actually, let's, um... My territory, because I want to cut down this area now. For my private... This is my private residence to keep, you know, you guys safe. What's the name of this game, you ask? Well, be sure to read the title in its entirety. Yeah, the amount of times a stream that we say, read the title, What's check the, the name of this game, you ask? Well, it's be crazy. sure to read the title in its entirety. I wish we got a new member every time the answer was, read the title, read the description. I wish we got a new member every time. Yeah, we have warehouses working for imports, exports. We got three of them right up here. And we do have workers assigned. Actually, how many people are uh, unemployed now? You always want to keep a little bit of unemployment, too, just in case. Oh, good. Now we have swords again. Ah, perfect. And they delivered ten. Excellent. Now everybody has a weapon. Bum, 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 bum. All right, time to switch classes again. Yay! Beautiful. Thank New you for the support. Shout out. And Sash, thanks for subbing. Appreciate that. Okay, so now we just got to train everybody, and then we can go on our first mission. And in the meantime, we will build my private home for me. For my safety. Bum, bum, bum. Bum, 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 bum. The answer is in the description there, Philip. Bum, 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 bum. Under the live stream tab. Bum, 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 bum. Okay, let's see. Let's build it right here. Uh, that's going to be my big mansion f for big pimping. Uh, to look down on the peons below? No, this is so I can read the description from here. Like, you gotta look really far across the kingdom. Because all that text... Do you know the Hollywood sign? Well, what I'm gonna do is we're gonna assemble 300 trillion tons of lumber, and we're actually going to write the description out in uh, letters along this mountain. 
It'll be one of the, uh, it'll be one of the monuments that you can see from space. Oh, this is gonna look cool. It's gonna be a nice, compact, uh, man mansion. And I shall call it Maryland Mansion. good okay let's see then let's do a little entrance here bum, 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 bum. well the more compact I build the building the more each one of these little buildings will count as a treasury so it'll extend the uh, coin storage by like um, like 300 or something like that bum, bum. Okay, let's try this. That looks kind of cool. And this will lead to a garden that will be out back. Eventually we'll cut down all these trees and stuff, and we'll make a garden out front. All right, so this is going to cost 211 planks and 102 stone. Wow, that's not even that much. That's not even really that expensive, but... All right. Wow. I know. All right, we'll get started with that. And we'll add some more uh, to that building later. You can, you can always come back and modify a building after you've modified it. All right, ne next person to become a Raptor Ultimate, we're going to name that giant mansion after you. So whoever wants it... You can either upgrade or become a Raptor Ultimate today. I know, kids. It's all part of the scam, but I got a McNugget addition, addiction, and they're not going to buy themselves. I wish they did. Bum, 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 bum. Yeah, it's a royal decree to read the description. Yeah, that's why I'm assembling all the lumber. It's going to be great. Okay, what else do we want to do? Yeah, so the Lord's Manor will be perfect for storing... Oh, look at that. It's actually going to be built. We're actually doing a really good job. We've already started on one of the buildings. I wonder if we can hire some more people for construction. What do we have for construction crews? Oh, yeah, we got a lot of unemployment now. Let's hire some more soldiers while we're at it. Perfect. Then what we'll do is we will add some more weapons. And we'll wait till our squads are fully trained. Soon. We actually might be able to send them out on two different missions. That might be a good idea. Bum, 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 bum. Let's build another builder's workshop in here. And we'll assign some more builders too. Uh, yeah, the... The mansion is about as far as a, a way that we can build it. But it's kind of hard to build palaces. You kind of only build, like, uh, structures that would resemble modern, uh, old-timey town halls. Like, this, this is pretty much like what an old town hall would look like. Eventually, we'll probably put a water slide in there. It'll look like Richie Rich's house. It'll be great. Well, thanks, Nick. I appreciate the support. And hello there, Tyler. Good to see you. Candy May, welcome back. Alternum Flux, hello there. Good to see you all here. Yep, the description is in the Discord, and the Discord is in the description. Two worlds collide. 
Okay, let's see. What do we got for unemployed now? Oh, good. Only three. Yeah, you should probably always keep, like, um... You should probably always keep, like, three or four people unemployed just in case you, like, have the idea that you need to build something. And then you have people available to actually, like, build. It's more like keeping them on standby for any future thingies that you want to do. Can we upgrade our people? Oh, promotions are available. Let's go ahead and promote by level. Anybody level 5 and above? Ah, Cooperage is now available. Is the Cooperage's name Stanley? Okay, let's go level threes now. And I think we'll stop there for upgrades. Um, oh, Sheldon Cooper. Okay, I, th I thought it was uh, Stanley Cooper. All right, the hop farm and the brewery are now available. All right, bros. Uh, one's in chat if you'd like a brewski. Or possibly a ecto-cooler high C if you're underage. You can't be liable for, you know, providing a minor with alcohol. I, I don't want to go back to prison. Bum, 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 bum. A bum bum. Okay. Oh, good. Houses are upgrading. Awesome. Bum, 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 bum. Money's coming in. We're almost ready to go on some missions, I think. We have 20 soldiers. We're probably going to go two groups of 10 on two different missions. Oh, we can already start assigning our uh, mansion to things like uh, treasury, treasury. Good. Check back later. Now we have a capacity of 2270. Beautiful. Bum, 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 bum. Bum, 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 Is there a navy in this game? Not yet. But there might be naval battles or something in the future. Most maps do have water to take advantage of the fishing, so I hope they add that. I'd love to see that. You'd buy me a beer any day? Oh, that's nice, you. Thank you. Oh, that's going to be really cool to make some gardens up here. This is going to be really nice. Uh, we don't have any taverns at the moment. I think we have to unlock that. Uh, can I build that yet? Yeah, we can't build... That's funny. They allow me to build a brewery and a hop farm, but we can't... We can't actually sell the alcohol yet. We have to unlock the tavern, I guess, with getting more certain population. To which I don't even know where I'd put it anyway, so... Um... Jeez, I'd, pro I'd probably end up buying this land next so we can actually get some flat land to build on. Or over here. Maybe I'll build this way. Oh yeah, and then we can build across the river. We'll see. Well, the mansion's looking good. Yeah, you can export the beer, but it's much easier to sell it locally. You make a lot more money by having a good tavern. If you put a tavern in a good spot and fully staff it and stuff, 
It'll be cooler than Adventures with the uh, Misners. Clicking and tapping that subscribe button. That's how cool it is. Woo! Okay, let's see. So we've got eight. Oh, we actually have quite a few problems now. Mostly related to homes. Oh, actually, they're building houses. Oh, never mind. They just need to be constructed. That's one of the things that's a little annoying in the game is sometimes it's like, oh, you need another church, and it's like, oh, I'm building a church, though. Oh. And you just got to wait till it's done before it fixes the problem. Wow, this looks cool. Look at that. Wow. You get a beautiful view of the uh, everything from up here. I could see my house from here. Oh, there it is. Oh. Um. All right, so as soon as those houses are constructed, people will be a little happier. And I think we're about ready to go on our first military mission. Yep, we're almost there. As soon as all the troops is, are trained, we'll, we'll send them out. Uh, there's no market here, but that's just because there's a market literally across the bridge. And I want to see if they'll walk to that one, so that way I don't have to build it again. Every time you build a market, it takes up... Every time I build a market, it takes like four employees to run it, and that's a pretty big chunk at this moment, so I'm trying to like conserve the amount of uh, workers so that way I can put them to something else. Did I forget to switch glasses, did I? No, I put on new ones, these ones. Somebody redeemed it a little bit ago. I think I'm good. I think. Mm, this mansion's gonna be a little more separate, but this right now this is kind of like our um, maybe tax office or something or vis visitor center, and then uh, this is like my personal uh, currency storage. Bum, bum, bum. Yeah, if you if you want to ask about any games, just jump on the general chat of the Discord. The Discord relatively these days is kind of quiet. A lot of people I think are doing more gaming than they are chatting, and people are just kind of like. Reading books, watching movies, and playing games. So there's not as much chatting going on. So if you have a question, ask me there. I don't think we need... I don't think I need the envoys anymore, honestly. Oh, wait, we should for the clergy. Oh, it's just for a trade bonus, though. Oh, we can unlock the regular church. Oh, and the small stone wall. Okay. Oh, there's the tavern. Okay. Uh, stone set for the manor. Ah, the tavern is now available. Good, good. I'll drink to that. Am I a kid? Yes, I'm only 12. All right, thirty-two hundred dollars in storage. That's that's still not enough for a military campaign. All right, if we build a little stone wall, maybe we could build like right here, something like that. Okay, let's hire some fishermen. Initiating members only again. Mode. Initiating members only mode. Oh my Initiating members only mode. All right. Members only. Let's throw her in, boys. Name the Stonewall Jackson? That seems like a good idea. Like the tax office, Jackson Hewlett? That's that's a good one. Okay, let's do... Okay, I gotta build a church now, too. Um, I guess I'll build a church when we expand over... I kind of want to just build the opposite way in which I built in our other video series. Like, last time... I built over here, like this was where my wheat farm was in the episodes. And then I think we started building over here. But I think what I want to do is just extend other ways, just to see how differently it'll work. So maybe we could buy this territory, build a town over there and an, an actual church. Or we could build another church here, I don't know. Oh boy. Housing is still a problem though. Let's not build anything until the... Construction workers are finished. Uh, oh, I know why it's taking them so long. They're over here building my mansion and everyone else is homeless. But that, that makes it fair. How else would I govern them? They're lucky that I'm here. Why, without, without my house complete, how would I tell them what to do?
more unfortunate souls. I think I want to build a fancier church up here. Maybe we'll uh, bulldoze this this old church. That was my favorite show with Bob Vila, by the way. You guys remember that one? This old church. What are you doing there, Bob? Well, I'm using the new Black & Decker jigsaw to make myself a pew. All right there, Bob. You guys remember. You me remember? You remember. Oh, maybe we could build a little church over here. We'll call it the Church of the uh, Scaffolding Knights. Uh, saints. Ladder Knight, I mean, Scaffolding Knights Saints. Bum, 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 bum. Apparently Indrid thought that was funny. She smiled a little bit. Or Indrid could be a boy. Who knows? I'm not judging. I'm just saying. Or could I? I mean, maybe, bro. Dude, bro. Let's see. Oh, you're a lady? Oh. Oh, a villager's leaving due to unhappiness? Oh, they didn't build the house in time. Oh, well. The Church of Scams, yes. May, may we get some uh, words words of Pinto? Let's read from the book of Pinto. Uh, let's see. Dear Pinto, give us this day a number one value meal with a uh, Coke, medium fries, and... Oh, could you also get, like, another McChicken on the side? Because, um... I'm kind of like Pinto, a little extra no! hungry. Well, we could build a church down here with kind of a fancier town. I could try to build a nicer town down here. And since I'll have more space, I should actually do it. Let's do it. And we'll ask our loggers to start uh, cutting, cutting some trees down. Oh, actually, wait, we already have a road going. Oh. Um. Raptor needs a tartan? No, I need I need a Quaker. Oats. Yeah. Quaker? Hardly newer. Hi, members. We're in members-only mode now. Do you guys feel safe now from those non-members? <laughs> Just kidding. You know I like the non-members too. At least we don't have to hear about the description for a while. Well, they didn't even cut down the trees over here. Lazy. Alright, are we ready to go on a military mission? Let's see. Uh, everybody is mostly trained. We better get How do them. I use dino dollars? No! Check down below in the description. Damn it. Um, alright, at least we don't have to, uh, send everybody out on another mission yet. Okay, we have 3,500... 4,000. We have 4,000 capacity for the, uh, treasury now. Increased to 4,200. So each one of these seems to be about a 200 capacity. It looks like we're still building two more, so hopefully we can bring back almost 5,000 bucks. Thanks for keeping me sane, Rap. Absolutely, dude. Thanks for the support. You guys are awesome. Thanks for subbing to me. Thanks for liking my videos. Thanks for watching. Thanks for becoming a member. Thanks for not spamming the number three in chat. That's my least favorite of numbers. Because I believe that's the... Wait, what, what number at McDonald's is the Chick-fil-A? I mean, the fish filet. I don't think I don't think I like the fish fillet. I just if I'm gonna get seafood, I don't want to do it from a fast food restaurant, you know. Although fish isn't really like a fancy thing, but I just feel like if I'm gonna get fish, I don't want it from McDonald's. Whatever whatever number you think the McFish the fillet of fish is, I mean, what did I call it? the McFish? Yeah, whatever whatever the 
Whatever the fish face number is, that one. Whatever that one is, don't put that number in chat. It makes me angry. Have I tried the old bay fish fillet? No? What happened to the new bay? Oh, new bay is me. Oh, I see. Okay. I'm the I'm the new bay one. <laughs> YouTuber, you're so funny. Okay, let's do treasury, treasury. Treasury. All right, we got 4,800. Uh, I think, we, wait, is everything done? Is this building done? Oh, it's done. Excellent. We will call this one. The McMansion. Excellent. Perfect, good. All right, now we can build a garden. I can always, ex like, build onto this thing, right? Like, we can always make it cooler. Bomb. Uh, let's see. So now we just need the lumberjacks to come down here and cut down that forest. Then we'll build a church. Then we'll build a steeple. Open the doors and look at all the people. It'll be great. An envoy is requesting an audience. Well, I guess he uh, was, <laughs> must have been a millennial. He hung around for about two seconds. Okay, now we have a ton of clothes. We have a ton of cash coming in. Boys, we have too much money. That should, that should be my new name is Lord Too Much Money. Yeah, we definitely need more space for homes, though, because these guys are getting kind of claustrophobic. Also, we can build to the other side. Good. See you later. Oh, all right, book. Thanks for dropping by. All right, let's bring back the non-members. Let's welcome them back by making some pizza rolls. Mom made pizza rolls, guys. I got the oven preheated, too, by the way. Does anyone want to pop their pizza rolls in? Combination. Pepperoni. Sausage. Cheese. Yeah. Just cheese? Oh. Trout, rockfish, catfish, rockfish, bass, tilapia. A lot of fish. Something seems fishy about that. Bum, 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 bum. Oh my god, mom made pizza rolls! She sure did. Oven's preheated, boys. Get a cookie sheet. They're ready to roll. Okay, so we're at 90% happiness. Oh, time for the military mission. I bet everybody's good to go. Uh, mostly trained. We got one person we're waiting on. They're still completing training. Oh my god, mom made pizza rolls! By the way, one thing I noticed in this game, when the troops level up, they change their outfits too. Like this is their level one outfit. When they become more skilled, their helmet actually changes. And then when they become knights, they actually uh, get like a red, they wear like a red cloak. You guys may have seen it in the, uh, in the videos. I think this is good enough. Let's accept some military. Let's accept some missions now. All right, prepare the men. And let's accept another mission. So no matter what, for these first few missions, we I always take losses no matter what. It just seems to be the way it the way it be. Let's send out our newbies. A lot of them may be killed in battle, but that's just the way it be. One, two, three, four. You got five, six, seven, eight, ten. Good luck to the troops. Three. There they go. Oh, that looks cool. Check that out. Nice. Bum, bum, bum. Uh, yep, we did all the stuff on the new DLC for City Skylines. Oh, success probability low. I should have sent everybody then. Oh well. I wasn't watching it because I was so used to winning all the time from the previous missions. 
That's okay. We can bring back our troops. What you really want to do is for the first couple of missions, you just want them to get experience because they're going to fail no matter what. So if you send them on the uh, harder missions, then they can get their skills up over time. But that's what happens in war. Don't go to war and not expect to take a loss or two. And those who come back will be experienced, and those who do not will be replaced. We've got plenty of troops remaining. Or people who can be troops. Let's assign more troops. Let's do 30. And these will replace our losses. These guys can start training. And when those groups come back, we will, uh... We will see what we can do. We, we Oh, you know what? I don't even think I should go to war because we don't... Well, whatever. When you send your troops to war, they get more experience through that than they could ever get training. So you kind of... What you really should do is maybe send them on easy missions, but you don't really get much XP for that either. So, Yeah, I think they'll add first person to Cloudpunk, I'm hoping. I did mention that on my Twitter. If you haven't followed me on Twitter and Instagram, folks, make sure you do. Come say hi, by the way. If you want to learn about uh, more things about upcoming games, I usually tweet developers, and they like tweet me and stuff, and I do key giveaways and stuff on Twitter. And Instagram, too. You can come say hi there. What's up, Storm Crazy? Good to see you. Hi there. So our troops are going to die. I think some of them are going to be defeated in battle, but you become a undefeatable. Once you bring back spears, once your people like capture enemy weaponry and start bringing back spears, you're unstoppable. Like seriously, like if you send out two knights on a mission with spears, they'll win every time. Okay, uh, let's. Oh, this area needs to be cut down. So as soon as this is clear, we'll build a church and a uh, mill and or well, and then we'll um, we'll be good. All right, what should I buy? You don't have a Twitter account? You can always make one for free if you want. Twitter can be a little spicy, but I don't really talk religion or politics or anything on there. I want to talk about game. Gaming is kind of my thing, but I do realize that a lot of people go through tough times and they turn to my channel for relief and such. And so I'm proud to be here entertaining you guys, and I'm glad that you find me entertaining. Or at least mediocre at best. It's nice to know. You know what we should actually do down here? We should build another Lord's Manor and a church. If we build a Lord's Manor here, we can store more gold. And if we build another church here, we can actually attract more people. It's so another good thing about the Lord's Manors, too, is that it actually attracts people. So it actually makes it... Uh... Oh, we were victorious. Excellent. Uh, let's go ahead and bring the troops back. We just want them to get more XP. That's all. All right, the troops have returned. Where are, where are the troops? Ah, oh, there they are. Look at them all smashed together. I can't tell how many survived. Is it two? Is it five? Oh, looks like all the troops came back. Good. Or at least they were victorious, I thought. Hey, welcome to those new subs. Thanks for subbing, guys. Appreciate that. Oh, man, we need to make more training dubbies. We got a huge army here. Oh, looks like we have 17 soldiers, so we lost quite a few. But apparently they were victorious, so that's good. Well, let's start building some more training dolls. All right, let's try this. One. Two. Looks like we failed the other quest, but that's what happens. Once we get a knight, and once we get some spears, we are unstoppable. Actually, that's why you want to send them on very hard missions, too, because that has the best... That has the best booty. And you know how we all feel about booty. Okay, we got 21 troops. Do we have any spears? Oh, we brought back spears. Perfect. We shall name them Brittany. Oh, dude. Yeah, we're going for more of a military build this time around. It's going to be awesome. We're going to build a huge military nation. 
Oh, look at that. They are training. Sar Burden of the Crown? Never even heard of it. Sounds cool, though. Oh, looks like we don't need that money storage anymore. I need to build another uh, barracks, I think. This is cool. We're going to have a lot of military units coming through here. Are these trees clear yet? Oh, uh, not quite. Bum, bum, bum. What do we have for unemployment? None? Okay. Well, so long as we got money in the bank, happiness, and people coming into town, we're good to go. I'm prouder than Bob Ross watching somebody paint for their first time. Build another fort on top of the mountain? We could do that. But right now, all I gotta do is just get everybody trained. We are kinda running out of space, though. Let me, let me give these guys a little bit more breathing room. think so, sir. Hey, Justin, thanks for the five. Appreciate that. I appreciate your support. You love my videos? Well, I appreciate your support. Thank you. All right. Well, Raptor snapped, and now he's becoming a military dictator. So now, now, now we have a uh, military nation. Probably move these barracks over here. And actually, if we cut cut down these trees, we can extend it even further. Boom. Perfect. But we'll get there over time. Keep in mind, too, every, every military mission you go out on, your troops always come back wounded. Like there's always a few of them that are wounded. Scammed her, yes. Uh, what is this now? 21? Yeah, I'm going to wait till we get a group of 25. I'd like to do 30, though, and send out 15 and 15. I think that would increase our chances quite a bit. And we'll kind of thin out all the people who... You know, anybody who dies, we'll just replace them, and eventually we'll get... You know, veteran after veteran after veteran will be in the military, and then they'll be very skilled... That's another way to get yourself out of a financial problem, too. If you need money in this game and you need it quick, you can build yourself a uh, Lord's Manor for pretty cheap, like I did up here, and then uh, go out on a military conquest and fill that thing with booty. Then I'll probably build one down here, and then we'll build a church, too. We'll build another Lord's Manor. Then we'll build a bridge on the other side, maybe? It's nice that they put a blue line at the bottom. That helps to see the edge. nice.
Uh, we can't build a stone bridge at the moment. We have to unlock it first. But basically, I'm just building uh, Lord's Manors now to store all that money. Okay. Get some more weapons deployed. Luckily, when you tr when somebody trains, you can give them a different weapon, and they still retain their training. Like, the experience isn't connected to them with their experience with that weapon. It's just with the soldier. I'm an architect? Kinda. I mean, I got good at this game in terms of, like, maximizing space usage and making things look, like, somewhat decent. I, th I think this looks decent. Bum, bum. Uh, you can't build houses in the game, but you can designate areas for people to build. Which is why I'm building this down here. So that way it'll increase this area's desirability. And then when we cut down all these trees, then I can tell people they can build homes in front of the Lord's Manor. We're going to build a church too, and that'll take care of some more of our kingdom's needs. We shall cater to their needs. Okay, let's do... Um... Oh, good. A few unemployed. Excellent. Yeah, we'll put a, put a well down there, too. Let's actually get 30 people. Look at me. My, my biggest military yet. I've never had more than 20 troops. Yeah, what do we need? Two more? Excellent. There's the two new people who want to join us. Fools. Fools. Yep, we're still streaming for a little bit longer, so if you want to see this stream continue again in the future, make sure you smash that like button. And let me know you're here, because YouTube's been, like, broken lately. I don't even know who's actually watching anymore. Bum, bum, bum. Okay. Two more people are on their way. gonna look nice. Bum, 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 bum. Oh, I want two more people to join the military. Wow, look at him train. Oh, this guy's got a spear. your first time seeing it live yeah it's a good game all right we're gonna go for military this time so we'll wait for everybody to train up and then we'll try to send two groups of 15 out on a mission to get our xp up until everybody's fully trained so we'll play the waiting game we're gonna wait for trees to be cut down manor to be built then we'll build a church then we'll build a well then we'll build a marketplace then we'll tell people they can move down there that should help to increase our happiness and a few people need to go to church, so that'll build. That'll be the church taken care of. And nobody else wants to build a house at the moment, so that's fine. A day-night cycle? That'd be kind of neat. I think it's something that I'd want to have off, though, because this game's just too pretty during the day. And I do the same in, like, City Skylines, but it's always nice to throw your, your game into, like, nighttime mode and see what your park looks like at nighttime in, like, uh, Planet... Uh, Planet Coaster or Planet Zoo or what have you. It always looked pretty, like me. Bum, 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 bum. Bum, bum. Ninja training? Oh, yeah. See, that'd be cool if there were mods for Japan. It'd be awesome to have, like, feudal Japan with ninjas or, like, uh, the Middle East or to be able to have, like, uh, Cossacks train on horses. That'd be so cool. I'd love that. Bum, 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 bum. 
When is the next TerraTech video stream? That would be down below in the description. In the schedule section down there. How long is this? Oh, you know what? Actually, I can already assign this as treasury. Now we can hold 5,500 and 40. Good. Good. Uh, a great hall attracts an envoy, which you can do to increase your uh, influence with different factions like the clergy, the king, or the people. It's just another way to generate it. You can also pay your bailiff to do it, or you could just ignore it if you're busy with other stuff. You don't you don't necessarily have to do everything all at once. Just take your time and keep her slow. Like me, sometimes I just get bored of like you know, like cutting down trees and stuff and then I'll just go work on the Lord's Manor, which this one's complete. Excellent. Now we just wait for the trees to be cut down. We've told our loggers to go over there and start work. They're probably working up here too, but let's turn that off. That's good for now. Uh, everyone looks like ants from here. Oh, that's because they are ants. Yes. And I'm sure there's uncles and grandmothers here, too. Awesome. Thanks for supporting the stream there, farmer. Do you have enough warehouses? Probably never. But again, remember, in order to get those warehouses to work, we need to hire people to actually work at those warehouses. And if we build warehouses, that's going to cost us money, and if we spend money, that means we kind of have to sometimes just let things be. Buildings can actually store quite a bit of materials at the actual building, too. Like, for example, there's a lot of flour that can be stored at the, uh, at the mill. I do want to build another bakery, though. We should do that. We're starting to get a lot of people living here. And I think we'd probably tuck a bakery in here. That'll be good. Bum, 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 bum. Oh, look at this. There's a lot of troops training there. Excellent. Alright, we just got two wounded. A couple more, couple more people to train. Nice to just watch the city. Oh, that fence is a little tight, though. Now, I don't want to do any more promotions yet because we have people who need church, and so I need to clear land first build another church. What I'm hoping happens is that more people build houses up here and then I can build a change this rustic church to an actual uh, regular one. Thanks, Connor. Appreciate that. What I'll probably end up doing is building a much larger church up against this corner. But 
But the fancier church just adds, I think, more splendor. It doesn't really increase capacity. It'd be nice if a like higher quality church had more capacity for people. I think they do take more materials to build, so it'd be kind of nice as a trade-off that a fancier church gave a little bit more than just like um, gave more than just materials, you know. money again. It's ridiculous. Oh my god. Oh wow, this person upgraded their house too? Jeez. Alright. Well, we gotta squeeze in another temporary church, I think. Right now we have one, two, three, four churches, rustic churches. I want to build a nice one down here. Let's build it right here. Although the problem is I don't think people are going to walk this far from the other towns to get here. So this one's just going to be for this town. And these churches take a lot more materials to build, dude. Yeah, plants and flowers increase desirability, but not, not too much. We'll just build kind of like a little, maybe a little chapel here. Nothing too crazy. Just something, uh... Yeah, I think we'll just start with... Mm. No, that doesn't look right. Two towers, it just increases the material demand. Sometimes the simpler you make things, the faster they can be built. Also, this needs a church bell. Wait, doesn't the tower count as a church bell? Uh, guess not. Let's just put like a little bell tower outside. That kind of look cool. All right. Boom. All right, so now... That's extra space, but we really just need a bigger church up here. Although, anything longer than, like, one just looks weird. Uh, the area with the new church isn't even populated with anybody, so... Until we clear that forest over there, nobody's gonna really move in. Eh, I don't like that. Hmm. Bum, 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 bum. Whenever I come back to your stream, I get an Raid Shadow Legends ad? Really? Like, when you just tune in? That's weird. Yeah, as soon as this forest here is clear, we'll make a new, uh... We'll make a whole new town on this side, so that'll bump up our population. Right now, people's major demand is just religion. So it means I just gotta make some more cheapy, rustic churches, but I'm kinda like getting bored of those. And maybe I'll just make a little church of temporary over here. Yeah, you know, we'll make a temporary, church temporary over here. be like an emer emergency uh, shelter church. I 
Oh, why is it not sitting flat? Oh, the roofs are not gonna... Oh, man. Oh, boy. How about... What if we make a church like that? What do you guys think? Good? Uh-oh. An OCD alert is going off somewhere in someone's mind. Alright. No? Not a good idea? Okay. We'll just build a small little one. Uh, I can add to the others, but they're pretty much up against the wall, and I don't, I don't, I just don't have room. That's all. We'll just, we'll just build another church of temporary right there. Bum, bum, bum. Chickens. Oh yeah, that'd be cool. Chickens would be cool in the game. I'd, li I'd really like to see something more on the side of. Um, Just another big building to build, like a Burger King or something like that. You know, just a big building to bring people together. Churches and monasteries, yeah, you know, they kind of have a history of bringing people together, but nothing brings people together like the great taste of the Burger King Whopper. <laughs> Hi, guys, I'm Raptor, the Rap Pack. Did you know that uh, all that healthy food is good and all, but all of your feelings and stuff can be made better by just eating a, eating a Whopper? That's all you got to do. Well, it seems like they're adding new styles of buildings, like a Roman church and a legacy church. So you're definitely getting different feelings of, like, ancient Europe. Like, medieval Europe, I guess, but... The closest Burger King is 45 minutes from you? Uh, fun fact, Z-Wood. If you speed, things take less time to get to. Doesn't, doesn't take a long time if you're not planning on living a long time by doing 90 on the freeway. Build a secret church? Um, that's an idea. I don't think we're building anything else at the moment anyway, so that church should be built pretty quick. Oh, the other church, too. Jeez, it's going to be weird if people walk all this way to go to this church. I'm basically just pre... I'm laying out this city before we even, uh, like, allow people to live here. But right now, they just want more churches. Some of them are not, like, too full. Like, this one's at half capacity. But, 20 people want a church, so we better build an emergency relief church. An overflow church. Z Wood says we need more members, and he wants you to click or tap the join button. Yeah, kids, join the scam now by clicking and tapping that join button. Plus, if we hit 15 new members, I have giveaways for all new members. As long as you guys are watching, you have a chance to win. Oh, look, troops are out on patrol. Oh, no, they're just going to church. And they're done. Hmm, looks like this one's full again, too. I should make, like, one of those, like... Uh, oh, I always forget the word of it. T evangelicists or whatever. You know, you know the big TV dudes, the TV priests or whatever. Like, hey, if you guys, uh, you know, want to be uh, cured of sadness, send me a bunch of money and I'll send you holy water in the mail. Like, um, okay. Oh, cool. I like how it shows the edge of the map by putting like a road marker. That was a Steve Martin movie, was it? Yeah, isn't that... Oh, televangelist. That's that's the word. Televangelist. Yeah. Yeah, I need to build a mega church the size of, like, five Ikeas. With a parking lot the size of, like, an international airport. I don't know why, why people would go there anyway. Watch it on TV, first of all. Oh, good. Good. 
The Burger King construction is almost complete. Yeah, they're working on the drive through over here. Looks like we need more stone. I haven't figured out where any more is. Gotta be some around here. Yeah, you can add more cores to churches, but they look goofy when they're... These rustic churches, I built enough of them to know that they kind of look goofy when they're long enough. Uh-oh, and now we got bad weather coming in. Oh, dear God. Uh, Kevin Daly wants a kiss. Yes, Karen is here, and she wants to speak to your lips, Kevin. Don't you worry. She just wants to speak to your lips managers. That's all. That's all Karen wants. I'm sure, I'm sure she'll be in chat in any minute to speak with your manager. You have rocks on the left hill. Yep, there we go. So that's where we can move our... Uh... Oh yeah, do we own that already? Oh no, I'll have to buy it, but... Yeah, we could do mining up there if we want to. In fact, I think we'll do that so that way we can move our mining operation out of town and make the land there more appealing. Maybe somebody will build a house here and here. As you can see, the desirability effects. It really negatively affects that area. But as soon as we move that out of there, boom. People are going to be moving in faster than Karen to the back room to speak to the manager. Uh, I recently bought this and then returned. Should I try it out again? Uh, I'd say so. It's a game that keeps... Every time that a new update comes out, I'm interested in playing it all over again. And it's it, it doesn't seem tedious or boring. It's nice that you can customize all the important buildings in a town, like the you know government buildings and the churches, and you can build bridges where people can actually walk across canyons and things like that, or ravines or whatever. Pretty cool. I'd say if you if you have any interest in it, give it a, give it another try. Give it another try. Hmm. Okay, so our bi big old crazy mega church is being built, and our second little old little old church is being built. I think we should send the team out on a mission. Is everyone trained? Good. Thirty troops are ready to rock. Let's go out on some missions. Let's accept two super hard missions and see who comes back alive. We'll take that mission, and that mission. Alright, let's send the troops out. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Good. Wait a minute, am I taking people away from that mission? Oh. I didn't know you could do that. No! Oh boy. <laughs> Oops. Well, somebody's gonna die. Oops. Well, I guess the goal is really not to have them not die. It's mostly to get them experience so that way they can, can succeed in future missions. First try, though, guys. But this is the cool part. This is what I wanted to see, is check out these, like, military convoys. What I really plan to do is, when they get their experience up high enough, I could send them in groups of ten, and we could do, like, three missions at a time, where, like, the, the chance of success is 100%. And they will kick butt.
Oh look, it's the march of the new members. Look at how happy they are. Wow, that looks cool. Why all the girls? Ah, it doesn't matter in this game. It's basically just per just person with a number. Like, look at it. If you look at their statistics, like, this is literally just called novice female number 1661. What really matters... God, look at that face. Dear God. Oh. Oh, my God. That's... A, that... Never mind. That's, that's a warrior face right there. That... Let me see your war face. That's her war face. Dear God. Oh, oh, boy. Apparently, she has a, uh, a battle axe already. Can you give them names? Uh, I don't think you can actually rename them. This is something they'll work on later where they get more names in the game. Alright. So we'll just keep sending out and training troops and they'll die and they'll come back and get more and more trained and we'll keep repeating the cycle until we have an experienced army. Alright folks! We'll see how they do when we play this game next time. We'll send them out to war and see who comes back. I'll see you guys tomorrow for some uh, Industries of Titan. And if you uh, want to know when I'm playing games next, make sure you check down below in the description and check that schedule. Read it in its entirety. And I will see you guys next time. Thanks for being here, everybody. Welcome aboard to the new members. Thanks to everybody subscribing. I hope you all have a pleasant afternoon. And I'll see you all tomorrow. Good night, guys. See you soon, and thanks for dropping by. You're one of the best communities on YouTube, so I appreciate having your uh, attention and your love and all of those lovely, lovely, lovely Karens. I'll see you guys next time. Bye, everyone. See you soon.